the hardest part there to convince the, the world to consume less, especially those who have nothing, um, is not my place to do. But I would say you look at the super consumers out there, the upper middle class and the super upper class of a place like California, Van Nuys Airport, which is in my district. That's where all the private jets, all the most famous people in the world fly in and out every day. That airport is polluting not just our backyard, but the whole world. And so you may act green and you may have, you know, great, great sort of branding, but we are culpable in that way. And so I think there is, there has to be some accountability, especially for the ultra rich, which California is the epicenter for maybe the whole world to say uh, oh, that excessive consumption and that glamorization of wealth, the selfie on a private jet, you know, to get those Instagram likes, that shouldn't get you likes. That should get you whatever the thumbs down is. It's, um, there should be a shame associated with that celebration of wealth when people are dying out there that I don't think has made it into our cultural conversation. And so as a cultural exporter, as the home of Hollywood, um, I think it's our obligation to also tell a little different story to people that maybe modesty is sexy and maybe humility and walking softly and maybe eating less indulgently and less meat and driving forever and flying your jet wherever you want, you know, that's not a sign of wealth. That's actually a sign of some kind of moral poverty. So.